my name is Pranshu Jahakirdar. I have been studying in Allen Career Institute since the 9th standard. Living in a metro city like Bengaluru, I decided to pursue neat preparation for my 11th and 12th. Considering the wide choices that were available to me, it was a very important decision to make. I had already enrolled in Allen since the 9th standard because my brother was also here. Considering the infrastructure, the benches are of very good quality as well as there is air conditioning in every classroom. I also believed that the faculty were very very interactive as we had regular doubt sessions in the 9th and 10th. So I decided to pursue it for my 11th and 12th. As to why I chose my neat preparation, it was because I decided that to have a proper purpose in my life, I wanted to leave a footprint behind on this planet and I decided to dedicate my life to servicing others. I faced a lot of personal struggles during my preparation. The first one was being that a lot of us being in the 10th standard don't take studies too seriously. Neither did I. As I I always used to do well in the tests with a few hours of study. But 11th and 12th is very demanding, it requires proper dedication, so I decided to dedicate myself completely to my studies. The biggest distraction that everyone faces is the social media. I decided to deactivate my social media accounts for 11th and 12th and decided to use them later because those two years are the time that none of us will get back. So I decided that I would consult with my teachers and make sure that I would cut myself off from all the distractions. But I decided to pursue extracurriculars also, like occasionally I used to go out with my friends and play football here and there. Another distraction that I used was music. After the tests where nothing was to be done, I used to listen to music as it helped me clear of myself of all the thoughts that I had, even if I had a bad or good exam, and prepare myself for the next week where new chapters had to be learned. In our preparation, a lot of us will face us uh, challenging bad phases as well as good phases. For the bad phases, suppose a bad test result, I always used to make sure that I didn't get too demotivated. For that, I used to consult my teachers, my parents as well as my friends. My parents played a very big role in this as they did not apply any pressure on me at all. They always supported me and motivated me throughout my journey. My teachers too were very confident in myself and my abilities. And another way that I used to uh, deal with the bad pressure was that I used to just study even more because I used to set goals for the next test and uh, I used to try to achieve them. If I did not achieve those goals, I just used to simply keep on doing that until and unless I did it again. Another question that my juniors have for me is how often did you study? As a student, I would suggest that with classes it is very possible to achieve 6 hours of study. Obviously, it is quite hard to remain productive for those complete 6 hours but I made a goal to myself that at least I would sit down for 6 hours and no matter what it would take, I would just stay there without any distractions. My teachers would also suggest that since NEET is a 3 hour long exam, we should keep our study sessions for 3 hour long before taking any breaks, which is what I pursued. In my holidays, I used to study for at least 12 to 13 hours with 1 hour breaks. So essentially, I used to always pursue keeping 3 hour study sessions with breaks in the middle where I would do other stuff like talk to my family, my brother as well as go outside to play football. The Allen study material is one of the most important tools that I used during my preparation and that was not only the NEAT study material but as well as the JE study material. Both of them are very well handcrafted by experts in Kota. What I noticed was that there was a very diverse range of questions that we could use to better our preparation because what we face is that different types of tests can have different types of challenges. In an easy paper, the challenge is the time while in a hard paper, the challenge is the questions. So the Allen study material well equipped me to face myself as well as in the final NEAT exam which was was unexpectedly more difficult than the previous exams but the Allen test series also had this quality as a student I have given all coaching test series but I noticed one difference in Allen that it was not monotonous and it had many different types of questions that I always used to find new new questions to pick out and use for later improvements my exam strategy was to start with physics as I felt confident in physics and I always try to dive deeper into the concepts I used to always consult with my teacher for concepts that I had doubts in as well as for chemistry my chemistry faculty as well as my bio faculty apart from teaching the academic part they always kept a check on our mental and emotional status and made sure that we were not getting burnt out and we were always ready for the next challenge another thing that helped me during my preparation was the allen app which helped me analyze my paper during our preparation analysis of test papers is a very important tool that we can use because if we stagnate our marks then one of the most important ways we can improve by 20 30 marks is to analyze our test papers the allen app had various provisions to do this we have an improvement book to go through our past mistakes so so when I was in the auto coming to class or going anywhere, I could always open up my phone and look at my improvement book instead of doing other distractions. I also used the Allen app for a descriptive analysis of the mistakes that I made in every subject with proper solutions. Instead, if, if my teachers were kind of busy, then I could just go on the app and get a direct solution there, go through that solution and work on the next mistake. Another feature that the Allen app had which was very beneficial to me was the custom practice. Custom practice enabled me to create a custom test of as many questions I needed of whichever topic that I 
I wanted in whichever subject I wanted which is because there was so much flexibility in choosing the aspects of that test I found it very beneficial because it catered exactly to my needs in that moment of time of my preparation The last 30 days to the exam can be stressful for any other aspirant. During this period of time, we start feeling high anxiety and pressure. The best thing to do is to first conserve our mental peace of mind by practicing meditation and other sorts of activities. My dad as well as my friends suggested me to do this as I was someone who used to easily get panic during the exam. This helped me to calm myself down. The second thing would be for physics, I used to simply go through my short notes of the formulas as well as the important points from my notes. I also went through important highlighted points in NCERT. Graphs were extremely important as the They are very commonly asked in NEET. I studied the graphs of NCERT thoroughly for both physics and chemistry, including the diagrams. Chemistry and biology, I went through the NCERT completely again, and I feel like that is very doable. As we all know that for NEET aspirants, the NCERT of bio is almost like the Bible. My message for the upcoming juniors would be: first of all, don't get scared, don't get uh, panic. Everyone can feel a little stressed out considering the difficulty of this exam, comparing it to the previous years. The first thing is to trust your preparation and trust your own self. Be confident and be proud. The second thing is that I would suggest for any neat aspirant or any aspirant for that matter of fact, the most important thing is your company. Make sure that you do not get yourself in the bad company during these two years. Always surround yourself with like-minded people. I found myself to be very benefited by this activity. My friends and me used to discuss important questions and doubts, but not only that, when we all were feeling down. we all used to make jokes and laugh together about it i feel like the most important thing is that only and the second thing would obviously be to trust your teachers trust allen trust the allen system and if you go to allen then it's going to be the most wonderful experience i already miss my 11th and 12th right now only so all the best